Let's take a minute for safety and learn how to avoid moose stalls. What? A moose stall is an Alaskan term for any stall that occurs at low altitude while a pilot's concentrating on maneuvering something like a moose on the ground. Texans call them coyote stalls. Crikey, that's right, mate. And down under they call them roost stalls. But whatever you call them, they're fair dinkum something to be avoided. You bet. Maneuvering flight accounts for the most GA fatalities. And maneuvering while you're low and slow is just asking for trouble. A typical accident scenario involves flying a friend who wants to photograph something on the ground. You'll want to be close in order to get a good shot. Of course, you'll be a 1,000 feet AGL in populated areas. But that's not a lot of room when you have to maintain a circle around a point on the photographer's side of the airplane. And it seems they're always pressuring you to go lower and slower. That's why it's important to have a good pre-flight briefing where you explain what you can and, more importantly, can't do. And while we're on the subject, who says you have to fly a circle anyway? Wouldn't it be safer to be straight and level as you fly by the target and then set up for another pass? Good point, Jay. That way, the pilot can concentrate on the photo run without the added complexity of maintaining a turn. At the end of the run, the pilot can devote full attention to turning and setting up for the next pass. And it could be less annoying to folks on the ground, too. Always a good idea to keep the neighbors happy if you can. Practicing ground reference maneuvers with your CFI is a great way to prepare for a photo mission. And you can get credit for flight on the WINGS Pilot Proficiency Program. That's right. There's nothing like the confidence and peace of mind you get when you're flying at the top of your game and WINGS is a great way to document and maintain your proficiency. Want to learn more? Go to FAAsafety.gov to view all the Minute for Safety videos.